My name is Benny Tunkep. I work for Water Meter Division. I'm a Supervisor 1. Been with the city for 18 years. My name is Ruben Pisano Jr. I've been in the department for uh, 16 years. We got a Mars 51010 bench. We, we are bench testing water meters. We just want to make sure that the meters that we get from our vendor is being you know, read accurately. We don't want meters being over-registered or under-registered, especially during the time of uh, our, our drought season. We start by adding the meter number. The system has been purged already. We took out all the air in the system, all the cavitation. After we insert the meter number, that's when we start the, the meter test, and we'll run the, the high, the medium, and the low flow. So through AWWA standards, there's a high, medium, and low flow test that we run. Each of those flow tests, there's a certain amount of uh, gallons that are running through the meter. So in the high flow, on a three-quarter inch meter, there's uh, 25 gallons per minute running through the high flow. After the high flow is completed, the medium flow is ran at uh, three gallons per minute. The low flow ran at 0.5 gallons per minute. Right now we're running the, the high flow test. I was raising the, the pump control target in order to get our, our target of 25 gallons per minute. We need to get an actual flow at above 18.75 or over, and we are. We're, right now we're showing 19.68 gallons per minute, so right now it's, it's a valid test. The test usually runs about, I want to say 30 minutes on a, on a full bench. So when the meter fails, we don't send it out to the field. This is important to run these new meters coming in from our vendors to make sure that our meters are accurate and we're not you know, wasting any water. <laughs>